Friends, here I am in my office, and I'm actually looking at the, the blueprints of our sanctuary, the original design for the foundation and the walls, and of course, the beautiful slate roof. But I'm also thinking about our stewardship campaign for 2022. October 24th is our annual Promise Sunday, where many members will bring their pledges sealed in an envelope, place them into the offering plate. We will sing the doxology and then bless them. Some of you will mail your pledges in before, some after, but Promise Sunday is sort of the focal point of the stewardship campaign. I was thinking about, though, the campus and the building and the foundation on which this church was built. And then I realized that the foundation is not to be found in the blueprints. But the foundation is Christ Jesus. You know, it was but six months after this sanctuary was dedicated in 1929 that the stock market crashed. And America was plunged into its greatest economic crisis in its history. They had thought and planned that by 1934, they'd have a budget of almost $40,000 in this congregation. But as 1933 was coming to an end, they planned for a budget of $8,000 in 1934, a fifth, only 20% of what they had expected. But they did something rather remarkable. And the spirit of their decisions continues to guide us this day. They decided to increase two areas of their budget. One is for the mission and outreach of the church. They knew that more people were in need than ever before, and they wished to help their neighbors, both those that they knew by name and those whose names they may never know, to care for their neighbors. And then they increased what they were going to use to support the faith formation of their children and youth. They knew that no matter how difficult the times, Telling the good news of God's love to the next generation was central to who they are. In 2022, our priorities haven't changed much. Yes, we still care for the building uh, and the campus and this beautiful gift that we've received from generations before that is now our responsibility. But we also hope to increase our mission giving to support our neighbors in need. And we will continue to dedicate substantial resources to the faith formation of all ages, children, youth, and adults. I hope that you will consider generously supporting our campaign for 2022. These are difficult times, I understand that. Not everyone will be able to generously increase their support, but for those of us who are able to, I ask you to prayerfully consider a generous increase in your support for the ministry and mission of our church in 2022. These blueprints, they describe the foundation of cement and bricks and walls, but the true foundation of our generosity of spirit and of our hearts is found in our desire as a disciple of every age to follow Jesus' new commandment, to love each other as he has loved us. Thank you in advance for your support of the mission and ministry of the First Congregational Church of Western Springs.